Hey, so what's going on? I know it's been a while since I posted last. Um, really, you know, I love talking about things that people don't want to talk about. I love having, discussing them, like politics and religion and, you know, those taboo issues. And I necessarily don't change when I have a discussion with somebody. Sometimes I learn some amazing things, but other times I'm exactly the same coming out of a discussion than when I was coming in. But I feel like having discussions is so important to our development as people, just as human beings. Discussions with other people on how they believe and, and what they feel. and Maybe it not, might not change me, but it, it definitely broadens my outlook on life. So many people are so scared to have, I don't know, debates or or to talk about things that are uncomfortable to them. And I just feel like there's a loss or, or they just want to talk about it from their side and they refuse, refuse to listen to another person's side. The other day I saw on uh, Letterman, uh, Clinton was on and it was like a whole huge interview and it was really great so I, I checked it out and um, uh, Clinton had this the new book he came out with it was um, uh, uh, Giving and so I would mentioned my mom the next day my very conservative mom and I said oh yeah so Clinton came out with a President Clinton came out with a book uh, Giving and I think I want to check it out and she's like oh don't read anything by him He's uh, like, because he's, he's terrible, like, oh, you can't read a book by him? I was like, well, but it's it's not about, like, things I disagree with. I think it's the things I agree with him on. I mean, he's wrote this book about how a lot of people um, are getting dissatisfied with their life, um, their consumeristic life, and they want to help people now. And I agree with that, at least, you know, for the most part, it seems. And she's like, Oh, but there's other people who've written books that are better, like, that are, uh, like, that you could read that isn't by him. Like, why do you want to read a book by him? I don't know. Well, he's probably uniquely qualified by running a country for eight years um, to be able to, to tell me about that kind of stuff. You know? But, like, instantly, before we could get into it, it was just like a why. Why? Like, because he's from this other side, this other group, this, it doesn't matter. The discussion's closed. We can't have an actual conversation. I can't actually learn something from this man because uh, I disagree with too many things. So I can't learn anything from him. I feel like we're doing that all the time. And I've been having conversations with a lot of friends lately on how to, how to stop that response. Like, it's a natural response for so many people. You say one word, you say one name, a political candidate, a certain idea, an issue, and they're done. It's over. It's The, the topic is over before it started. There is going to be no discussion. And they're like, Pfft. and they get mad. You, you, you say, like, you know, Hillary Clinton. You know, like, George Bush. <laughs> like, depending on the side, I have... My, my like really radical friends and my like really conservative friends or people I know and, and both they both do it and like they want to fight you I'm like whoa or something or someone I'm like what did they do to you like you don't even follow politics at all you just know like two things about the issue you just know you don't like them you just have this feeling that you don't like this issue or you feel on this issue but you don't know anything about it why do you want to fight me so we've been talking, how do we change it? How do we maybe influence our friends, our society, ourselves, so that when that comes up, these issues come up, we don't just respond out of pure emotion, but that we take the time, and, and though these are emotional issues, and I guess we care about this stuff a lot, like try to learn, try to understand it more, and maybe be a little less judgmental to the other side because though other side probably has flaws, um, so do we in different ways. And then uh, the whole idea of sides to me is just kind of silly. Anyway, just some thoughts I had recently. Tell me what you think about it.